What's up, people? Today we're going to be doing underglow on the GTI. So I got this kit. It's uh, an Op 7 lighting kit, and it comes with two 48-inch light bars and two 36-inch light bars. We're not going to be using these. There's not enough room for the car, so we're just doing the two long ones on the sides of the car. It also comes with a mounting hardware, plenty of zip ties. The first step now is to go to the car and tap the fuse. So behind this panel, we have a fuse tap on the fan that's grounded behind this control box, and the control box is in some extra space. There's the wires coming from inside there, coming down and into the footwell of the car. The reason why I tap the fan fuse is that it, the lights should turn on when I turn the key on. There we go. Bang. So now the lights will shut off and turn on with the key. Now it's time to take the tire off because we're wiring through the front wheel. Here I'm taking off the shielding behind the wheel. This covers up uh, brake lines and there's a hole for an amplifier that I have already set up and I should be able to run wires next to it. Taking off that panel there was such a pain because I had to unclip the hood release latch and uh, you see the blue wire goes? That is my amplifier powering and I'm gonna drill a hole right next to it and down there I will have so I'll be able to send the wires for the underglow. I finally got the coat hanger through this hole into the car. Now I gotta take the wires for the underglow and send them back through the wheel well. All right, so I've tried many different ways now. In there, there's just like not enough room to get this connector in there. So next plan is to cut this wire right here, run some extra wire through, and then run it down inside, out the wheel well, solder back up this connector to the wire. We got the wires coming out from here. One's gonna be going straight along this edge and then the other one's gonna go around the car. I decided to ditch the extra wire. It was just completely unnecessary. So later in the video, I just soldered the connector straight to the wire with the red, green, blue, and the ground wire. I just finished soldering the connections. Now we're gonna test and see if this works. Hey! So what I ended up doing is I zip tied the light bars straight to the body. And now it's time to test it. She makes me go oh She makes me go oh 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 She makes me go So thank you so much for watching. It was a blast to do the install. I loved it throughout, except for the run-ins that I had. But it's just like life. You have a couple snags, but you stick through it and don't give up and you will succeed. Be sure to subscribe for more. I got more builds coming for this car. It's gonna be lit. I'll catch you in the next one. See you later.